Now that you got your tools, you need a place to store them. And that's where we are today. In this video, I'm going to show you a lot of different styles of tool storage, but I've also got a couple of little tricks at the end that you might want to stick around for. One of the first things to think about with your tool storage is whether it's going to be portable or it's going to be shop storage. My first tool storage was just a big box. Now for portable use these days, I use one of these tool bags. I like it for the organization and I can just put the tools in and reach in and get them. Next up would be the tool bucket bag. I've used a tool bucket bag before. They're really good for organizing. However, if there's nothing inside the bucket, then the bucket becomes top heavy and the bucket tends to want to tilt over on its side. Now comes the fun shop tool storage. First up in garage tool storage would be just a simple tool cart. And this tool cart here has drawers in it to store tools. It has a work surface on top, and it's really nice to move your tools around the shop wherever you need them. Shop tool storage changes like women's fashion. Right now, the big trend is to display all your tools. But I don't think anybody that's into tools can ignore all the beautiful toolboxes that are out there available right now. These rollaway chests come in multiple colors and they're huge, but they cost in the thousands of dollars and take up a lot of space. And one thing I got to tell you guys, if you're going to use your tools to make money, I've never had my toolbox make me one dime. And as I said before, the current trend is to display all of your tools for people to see. When it comes to rolling around tool carts, we have to pay respects to Adam Savage's design on this monster tool cart that he designed. This cart displays the tools, but it also makes them very convenient to grab without having to open a drawer. And I'll put a link to Adam Savage's video on this cart up in the top left-hand corner now. One of the big trends is French cleats. French cleats are just simply a couple of boards cut at angles so that they wedge together. The cool thing about the cleat system is you can slide the cleats left to right. You can move your tools to another cleat up or down as well. You can make these cleats customized to fit any kind of thing that you want to display on the wall. And this is what I've got in mind for a single car beginner garage tool storage is pegboard. I like pegboard because of its flexibility. It doesn't really take a lot of tools and knowledge to get pegboard up and running. In order for pegboard to work properly, it's got to be spaced away from the wall, and that leaves a big gap, which is a great place to install some LED flashing lights. And then to complete my storage area, I wanted to add some shelves on the left and the right of the pegboard so that I could put chemicals and other items that won't fit on the pegboard. Thanks for watching. I've got lots more to come.